Yo, what's up, everybody? It's the Orange Juice Bandit. And uh, this is my super relevant opinion on Holly Berry. And yo, is it just me? Or does Holly Berry have sex in every movie she's in? Just be real with me. Just be real with me. Every movie, she getting catcalled. Every movie, she she's doing the dirt. Every every movie, she's having sex in the movie. There's no nobody could change my mind. In every movie, she was doing it in every single movie. Okay, <laughs> look in this movie she was in. Their eyes were watching God. I don't know where she was at. She was in like Florida or something like that, and like um. She met some dude, his name is like Tea Cake or something like that, and he just, you know what they did, they they started dating, and they did the, and they did the thing, you know, they did the dirty, they did the, uh, what's that stuff called, shoot, I forgot, man, what's it, let me think, let me think, hmm, shoot, na- Snappy Nappy Dugout, that's what it's called, they did the Snappy Nappy Dugout, they dug out the snappy nappy, and uh, yeah, that's what happened, man. She just she she does it in this movie about maybe. I'm gonna give her the benefit of the doubt. I'm gonna say twice in three quarters. Yeah, twice in three quarters. All right. Now in this movie, Baps, B A P S. I don't know what that stands for probably stands for snappy nappy dugout yeah because snappy nappy dugout is four words and that has four words. snappy nappy dugout okay cool holly berry portrays georgia a hairdresser who moves to beverly hills to make her her wet dreams come true in comedy what what else what what else do i need to say it says holly berry portrays georgia who Portrays Georgia hairdresser to wait. <laughs> uh, I can read. Look, Holly Berry portrays Georgia hairdresser who moves to Beverly Hills to make her wet dreams come true. Snappy nappy dugout. So only only for one twenty five if you in the USA. So. Yeah, she obviously does it in the movie Snappy Nappy, in in the movie Baps. Um, inside is gospel and R and B merging. I don't know. Hey, I'm shoot. I, I ain't mad at it, but uh, yeah, man, she uh she does her thing in this movie as well. She she does it in every movie. In this movie, Gothica. It looks like. <clears throat> It looks like she's having, like, sex with rain in this movie. Maybe a few window panes every now and then. Can't really say too much. I haven't seen this movie, but... mm, I'm gonna assume she had sex in this movie. Like, I'm just gonna assume it. Like, you know, in this movie, she's obviously... Obviously just... Having sex with the rain. Okay. Next movie... All right, I don't know what this movie is, but she's with Samuel L. Jackson, brother of Michael Jackson. No, I'm just playing, but look, like, she's with Samuel L. Jackson. They're like hugged up. She looks a little pissed off. I don't know, or maybe she doesn't look pissed off. Maybe she does. Maybe she just she's just a little tired or whatever. That's just her face or whatever. It don't even matter. And yeah, man, that's just what it is. I guess she, whatever movie this is, I I can't say it for sure. But, pretty sure she had sex in this movie as well. Next movie. Next movie is, what is it? Catwoman. Y'all remember this movie? <laughs> ah, yo, y'all remember this movie? Yo, yo, yo. She was like, yo, she, was, she was like playing basketball and doing all this cat stuff and like the basketball. She was like, she was pretending it was like a ball of yarn and stuff like that because she's like a cat. You dig what I'm saying? And like... Like, her butt was in the camera and stuff. Like, her butt was all over this, like, guy and stuff. Like, and she's, like, twerking in the movie, basically. And I can't really say if she had sex in the movie. 
because uh, I, I just can't. Like, I, I ain't seen none, but according to my assumptions, I give it a 99.9.3 quarter percent chance that she probably did the snappy nappy dugout in this movie. She did the thing in this movie. So, yeah, I'm gonna just, just, gonna, just gonna leave it at that. <laughs> yeah. Alright, the call. In this movie, she probably uh, did intercourse with something, maybe a phone, I'm assuming. Or it's, it also says a chestnut and a berry, so maybe a chestnut and a berry was in this movie. I'm not sure. But it's, it seems to me like she was having sex with telephones in this movie maybe there's a lot of telephone booths in this movie and she went in like some telephone booths and did the did the thing did her did her thing in there but yeah that's all i can say about this movie haven't seen it but you know according to my assumptions and calculations she probably did what i what we all think or what i think okay x-men x-men is a superhero movie she played storm um, in this movie, see, I took a math class. The thing about this one, I took a math class, and X always means something different. X can mean 1,000. X can mean 4 billion. X can mean anything. You're always trying to find, excuse me, you're always trying to find the meaning of X in these movies, or in, in math. And, um, it seems like there's a lot of men in this movie, like too much men to count. That's probably why they named the movie X Men because they didn't know how much men they had in here. So I'm not sure how many men she dis like. I'm not sure how many men, you know, did the. But um, but you know, it's obviously a lot because it's called X Men and X can mean anything. Or it could be a little. I'm going to give her the benefit of that. I'm going to say one. Yep. Now, this is um Swordfish. In this movie, she's obviously having... She's obviously doing her thing with anim- like sea animals. She's moved from telephones to men to sea animals. So, obviously, she's doing things with sea animals in this movie. And cats. I forgot. I forgot. Okay, so she went from men, telephones, um... And uh, now she's doing, wait, she did men, telephones, cats, and now she's doing um, uh, sea animals. So if you're into like sea animals and stuff like that, I advise you watch this movie. I haven't seen it, but I can only assume that she's like made out like a shark or two in this movie. That's basically the best uh, analogy I could come up with for this movie. Maybe she like kissed a shark or something like that, and like the shark took her away. And, like, a whole bunch of people, like, went down there and, like, shot the shark up and stuff like that. And a submarine and stuff like that. You know, sort of like how King Kong took that white woman and brought her to the building. And everybody went up there and, like, you know, shot them down. And, you know, from the airplanes. And everybody was like, you know, rest in peace Harambe. That's, that's just what I heard. I can't call it, but that's just what I heard. Okay, next movie. Uh, Dark Tide. In this movie, I don't know. It's probably the same thing. More sea animals. It's probably like a sequel to the movie Swordfish. So it's probably like, you know, more sea animals in this movie. But maybe, I'd say maybe she's drinking a lot of water in this movie. Like, maybe she's like drinking waves in this movie or something like that. She does her thing. She's skinny dipping. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. She's, maybe she's skinny dipping in this movie a lot. I'm going to chalk it up to skinny dipping in this movie. And, uh, yeah, there's, you know, some dude behind her. He's probably skinny dipping chicken nuggets or something like that. But, yeah, that's all I got to say about Dark Tide. And last but not least, I think we all know. I think we all know what happened in this movie. I think we all know. And I don't think there's anything to say. I think that you know it's out there. It's, I think I, I think everything's good. I think I think 
I think this movie needs no explaining. I think, uh, I, I'm lost for words. This is, it's, you know, you know, that's just what it is. You know, she just, we all know what happened in this movie. And, um, I'm going to leave this video with a quote from, who am I going to quote? Man, shoot. <laughs> Yo, I'm going to leave this video with a quote from, uh, Donald Trump. Uh, um, I know I have money. Oh, yes, I'm so rich. I'm so rich. Ha uh, 